Hey, it's Central Valley Business. I'm your host, Steve Walling. My guest for this segment is Ryan McCormick. Ryan, Ryan, welcome to the show. Thanks, Steve. And congratulations. And I'm going to let you tell the folks what I'm congratulating you about. <laughs> oh, thanks. Well, in uh, 2004, I was uh, diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Uh -huh. uh, went through six rounds of chemotherapy. My wife was pregnant with our first child. And uh, obviously, I've survived. And I've, I've done a lot of work for Leukemia Lymphoma Society. Mm -hmm. We're originally from Indianapolis, so I did a lot of work uh, with them. Mm -hmm. Then we moved out here a year and a half ago for my wife's job. Uh, she works at UC Merced. And I contacted the Fresno chapter of Leukemia Lymphoma. Right. And I've done some volunteer work for them. And then they nominated me for Man of the Year. Well, you are Man of the Year. I am, yeah. yeah that's it. And uh, I, I'm in a... It, a national competition. Mm -hmm. It's man and woman of the year all star. Mm -hmm. And if you're an all star, it means that you've uh, done it before. And in 2013, I ran for man of the year in Indianapolis. So all right. I'm here to really try to put Leukemia and Lymphoma Society out of business. That's so. you know that's the best way to do it, man. Yeah. And I gotta I gotta ask you, you know, if you've noticed, he's got a little bit of an energy level, Ryan, in your in your dealing with, with the whole thing, I mean, there's obviously not a, a, an aspect of our life that, that doesn't affect when the doctor gives you a diagnosis. For you, to, you know, I believe personally that, that our, our mental outlook, you know, our consciousness, if you will, is extremely important. Uh, and obviously I can see that in you. You've got a lot of up energy and stuff like that. How how was your journey through this? I mean, you didn't just get here one day, bingo. You you had a journey. How did it go? Yeah, it was uh, it, it, literally it's one day at a time. You have to take it one day at a time, and you have to be you have to be positive because there's no other way. Right. Uh, I once we met with our oncologist, I had so much faith in him that I knew I was going to be okay, mm -hmm. and and he was just so smart and just gave me so much confidence. But it is one day at a time, and, and you just focus on that and just keep thinking about the light at the end of the tunnel right. and, and hope that it's not a train, mm -hmm. <laughs> right? But, you know, it, 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 you just all of a sudden you get there, and, and you realize you're a lot stronger and a lot better for mm -hmm. having gone through that. And, uh, and it's, uh, it's been a real uh, process within the family unit, too, hasn't it? Oh, yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah. I, I think the the the, uh, the the bond between my wife and I uh, can never be broken going mm -hmm. through something like that. Uh, she was tremendous through the whole thing, especially being pregnant. Obviously, uh, it, it was just a fantastic. Looking back, I mean, just the bond is is just incredible between the two of us, and uh, that's really what got me through. You know, sometimes in our darkest time, there's there's gifts that we can look back on and see how they've you know expressed in our life. But you've taken that, and you have moved beyond Ryan into the society itself, the 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 Leukemia the, the the society, society uh -huh. and and br brought it out to the world. Mm -hmm. Why is that important? Well, because there are so many people that get diagnosed with either leukemia or lymphoma, mm -hmm. and it not only affects that person, but then the family and the and the caregivers mm -hmm. and the friends. Right. Friends don't really know how to act. Uh, so what I want to do is just throw a positive light on it mm -hmm. and say, you know what, I'm still human. I still need phone calls and friends, and you right. know people need that. So that's what I'm trying to promote. Uh, not only with Man of the Year, but uh, I have a, on Facebook the new the new face of cancer with Ryan McCormick, uh -huh. uh, and then I have a website nutty-irishman.com where, <laughs> where I do uh, stand up. All right. Uh, so and then allstarryan.com is for leukemia and lymphoma society. Right. So it's important because uh, right now a lot of treatments for leukemia and lymphoma are being translated into other cures for mm -hmm. cancer. Uh, so that's kind of neat that, that leukemia and lymphoma is in the front. Forefront of this, yeah, this process. Yeah, using that for other cancers. That's great. And for someone that's just recently diagnosed, pretty good thing to get a hold of society? Yeah, oh, yeah, absolutely. They have a, a program called First Connection right. where they connect uh, a survivor with the person that's been diagnosed. They mm -hmm. try to keep it you know, the same age group and right. things like that. Uh, so that's a wonderful program because when you get diagnosed, you know, you think you're the only one in the world. Yeah. I mean, you know you're not, but you think that. Right. And, and so you need help. Right it becomes away. a very personal experience right up front. Mm -hmm. For you, Ryan, 
at what stage did you contact or get in touch with the organization? I'd say it was probably a couple of months after, right. just because of the whirlwind of getting diagnosed, and then you start chemotherapy, and mm -hmm. so it was a couple of months after, and it turned out to be a great contact. They were very helpful, and a lot of resources, and uh, you're just not alone with somebody like that. And that's very powerful and very important. Yeah. All right, that's a great story, and uh, man of the year, huh? Yes. <laughs> All right. Hey, I'm impressed. I'm sitting next to the man of the year. <laughs> I hope so. All right. Well. Best wishes Thanks. on that. Once again, how do we get a hold of the society? How do we get a hold of you? Yeah, the uh, Leukemia and Lymphoma Society is lls.org, uh, and it's the Central California chapter, Fresno. Uh -huh. And then I have two websites, allstarryan.com mm -hmm. and then uh, nutty-irishman.com. All right, that's it. That's how you get a hold of them. And if you, a friend or someone in your family, happens to pull that ticket, get in touch. Don't sit it out by yourself. It's very important. We'll see you when we come back.